these containers off of Amazon. Inside this pack of containers also comes a couple of these squidgy things, as well as a couple of funnels. These are also good for your liquids, but also your powders. My plan is to decant all of my primers into these containers. Primers, like all things, come in all different shapes and sizes. However, keeping them in containers that are all a uniform shape means you can fit so much more in your kit and everything is a lot more organized. The lids spin off really easy from these containers and then you're left with a great opening that you can squeeze your primers straight on into the container. It can be a little tricky getting some of your primers into these containers, especially if the primer you're trying to decant is a thicker, more silicon base. However, with a little negotiation, you can get it in there. My go-to trick, however, once you've squeezed everything that will come out easily, is to cut the top of your container. This then allows you to have a much bigger opening that you can get your spatula in and scrape down the sides. I repeat this process as I work down the container to make sure absolutely nothing is wasted. I still don't have any paper for my label maker, so I'm just getting a sheet of paper and writing out what the product was. I'm then sticking it onto my new container with some sticky 